Solving inequalities involving multiplication and division. Let's try an example. y over 4 is less than or equal to 7. Step 1. Solve the inequality. Use the multiplication property of inequality. You can multiply both sides of an inequality by the same positive number and the inequality will remain true. Multiply both sides by 4. Step 2. Graph the solution. Use a closed circle to show that 28 is a solution. Step 3. Check the solution. Substitute a solution from the shaded part of your number line into the original inequality. I chose 24 because it is easily divisible by 4. Substitute 24 for y into y over 4 is less than or equal to 7. 24 over 4 is less than or equal to 7. And 6 is less than or equal to 7. The inequality is true. Let's try another example. 6x is greater than 72. Step 1. Solve the inequality. Use the division property of inequality. You can divide both sides of an inequality by the same positive number and the inequality will remain true. Divide both sides by 6. Step 2. Graph the solution. Use an open circle to show that 12 is not a solution. Step 3. Check the solution. Substitute a solution from the shaded part of your number line into the original inequality. Substitute 13 for x into 6x is greater than 72. Seventy eight is greater than seventy two. The inequality is true. Let's try another example. Three is less than negative k over eight. Step one Solve the inequality. Use the multiplication property of inequality. If you multiply both sides of an inequality by the same negative number, you must reverse the inequality symbol for the statement to still be true. So we multiply both sides by negative 8 because it cancels out with negative 1 over 8. Reverse the inequality symbol. Negative 24 is greater than k. Rewrite negative 24 is greater than k as k is less than negative 24. Step 2. Graph the solution. Use an open circle to show that negative 24 is not a solution. Step 3. Check the solution. Substitute a solution from the shaded part of your number line into the original inequality. Substitute negative 32 for k into 3 is less than negative k over 8. 3 is less than negative negative 32 over 8. Three is less than four. The inequality is true. Let's try another example. Negative 5m is less than or equal to 80. Step 1. Solve the inequality. Use the division property of inequality. If you divide both sides of an inequality by the same negative number, you must reverse the inequality symbol for the statement to still be true. 
So we must divide both sides of the inequality by negative 5 because it allows us to cancel out negative 5. Reverse the inequality symbol. m is greater than or equal to negative 16. Step 2. Graph the solution. Use a closed circle to show that negative 16 is a solution. Step 3. Check the solution. Substitute a solution from the shaded part of your number line into the original inequality. Substitute 0 for m into negative 5m is less than or equal to 80. 0 is less than or equal to 80. The inequality is true. If this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.